Hey everybody, Dan Robino here with Windows Central, and we're very happy to announce that Bacon It is now available for Windows 10. See, I got the tile here. This is a completely rewritten from the bottom up app uh, for Reddit. If you're a big fan of Reddit as I am, uh, you can now go and grab this. Like I said, it is completely new, complete universal app. It can even work on HoloLens if you happen to have one of those. Um, we don't. But as you can see here, uh, absolutely gorgeous design on it. I really, really just love the way it looks. More importantly, it's very intuitive, and that's a tough thing on Reddit, because Reddit's kind of a weird thing to use sometimes. But as you can see here, I'm in right now um, in awe, so there's lots of cute stuff. Uh, and if I go here, you can see um, it's a very powerful app, much more powerful than a previous version. For instance, you can play full screen GIFs just fine. Uh, no issues there. You have your upvote and downvote. You have uh, comments. But what I really like about the comments is this. Uh, now I want to read what people are saying. I just have to scroll. And look how beautiful that is. It's a very intuitive design. I found it really simple. Um, you can go through your comments here. You can up and downvote them. You can, of course, reply to their messages as well. And you can just go right back to the message. Hitting the back arrow key, of course, goes back to the main uh, subreddit. Hitting it again goes back to the last one you were in. And if you keep hitting back enough, it'll actually go back to your main list of um, Reddits that you're subscribed to. And of course, you can log in here. You can see I'm logged in here into my name. Uh, and what's neat about it, because it's a universal app, this will sync everything over to whatever service you're running it on. So if you're running on a tablet or a PC, your login information transfers over there, as well as what you've already read and upvoted and responded to. And of course, you can now go switch to your different categories here and everything loads up. Uh, like I said, it just looks really, really nice. I, I think the, um, the, you know, Quinn has done a really great job with this. Um, and it's open source too, so all the code will be available for others to take a look at. There's, um, and they can contribute to it and as well as fix bugs and do that kind of thing. I haven't found too many bugs, to be honest. Uh, there, there will be a few because like I said, this is completely new. Um, it's, it doesn't share any code with the old version. Uh, now let's take a look here at the tablet version. And of course, since it's a universal app, it runs really well no matter where you put it. So I'm going to run it here on the clipboard for the Surface Book. And I love it. It's very much like the Outlook app, right, where it's got this nice background here. And of course, it can tie into your lock screen and even desktop. So you can pull down images and have them auto-rotate on your desktop if you're into that. Uh, same thing, though. Everything scales up really nice. And if you want to go down and read the comments, you just scroll this way. But I just love the way it scales. Like I said, this feels very intuitive to me. Uh, if I want to now bring up my other Reddits, I can go through and do that as well. Uh, put that as beautiful. And so you can basically tap here. Of course, you have the upvote and downvotes as well. Just a really great design, completely free. Of course, you can donate to the project. You can also contribute to the open source code if you want to. But head to the Windows Store now. Um, I think this is probably going to be my favorite Reddit app right now. I think a lot of you will really appreciate the design. It just scales beautifully to whatever device you're running it on. Even if you're going to use a mouse and keyboard, it's uh, you know much better than using it on a web browser. So there you go. Head to Windows Center for more information. And let us know what you think. Take care, everybody.